This is the lecture for Rafiq Hassan's The Provisionality of Property Rights and Kant's Doctrine of Right. So two topics. First, uh, the notion of assurance comes up again. So we saw assurance discussed uh, in the lecture for the Hodgson article last time. And specifically, you'll see assurance come up when Hassan is talking about the sort of the three problems in the state of nature uh, for Kant. And I think I scrolled past it. Here we go. Uh, so this is in section three. Uh, he starts talking about um, these issues in the state of nature. And uh, the first one is assurance. The second is indeterminacy. And the third is unilateral obligation. So uh, it's worth comparing and contrasting Hassan's view on this with Hodgson's view. I think they end up being pretty, well, there, there's similarities and differences, but uh, it's maybe keep track of what's going on with assurance. Second, uh, this Hassan article involves and especially uh, sort of begins with and then ends with some discussion of a topic that's come up uh, already, which is uh, what is Kant's view towards the redistribution of property? Uh, what is the state's role with respect to property in the state of nature? Is the state just to, supposed to protect people's property? Or is the state allowed to sort of redistribute property in various ways? And Hassan sort of goes through these two possibilities, points out how uh, these things that he calls weak and strong provisionality kind of point you in one or the other direction. He ends up rejecting both weak and strong provisionality. So he ends up rejecting those easy answers to what Kant thinks about the purpose of the state and the role of the state with respect to property. And so um, keep an eye out for what Hassan thinks the state's role towards property is supposed to be for Kant, which again, mostly comes up at the end of the article. 